The scramble to get Americans out of Taliban-controlled Afghanistan is proceeding quickly, with Fox News speaking to one Afghan-American who traveled to Kabul to get his family out. Trey Yingst reports from Afghanistan. More American citizens left Afghanistan today, many of them dual nationals desperate to flee Taliban territory. Esan Ola Mousin is an American who flew halfway around the world just to make sure his family got out safely. You're in St. Louis yeah. last month, yeah. and your wife and daughter are here for a wedding. And then the Taliban takes over, and you say to yourself, I'm going to get my family out, simple as that, you know, because I knew uh, one way or another, especially when the explosion happened with ISIS and then uh, the consequent firing upon the protesters or whatever happened, you know, it's, I just knew I got it one way or another, I got to get my family out. That's me. That's my daughter. Maryam, hey. While two-year-old Miriam is headed to America, Insaullah says more could have been done to help U.S. passport holders get safely out of Afghanistan. The Biden administration said there were contingency plans in place for the U.S. withdrawal. You experienced this firsthand. What's your reaction to that? It's not true. It's not true. I mean, this, this, it could have been avoided, but it's just never, you know, it's just too much hectic, too much disorder. I asked Esanola what he'll do first when he gets back to St. Louis. He said he'll give his mom a big hug. In Kabul, Trey Yingst, Fox News.